Hey guys, welcome back to my channel MI Tutorials. Uh, in this particular tutorial, I just imported a sample Excel file uh, which I have here with three columns, job type, due date and duration. As you can see here, my due date column is formatted into the date format. But when I imported the uh, data into the Power BI, BI is considering this particular due date column as a text, right? Now, how do we know that it is uh, in text? When I go to the column tools and here when I select the due date, it is telling me that this is in the text format. Now, how do we fix this, right? Because see, right now here it's giving me uh, in these numbers, the format is in these numbers. However, this is the date format, right? To fix this, we need to click on these three ellipses against the table that we imported and then click on edit query so that we get into the power query editor, right? And from here, you need to go to the transform tab and select the column that you want to fix. In this case, it is the due date column over here. And then we have the data type section here. And then what you can do is there are multiple uh, options here that are available. You have whole number, percentage, date time. So here we're trying to fix the date, right? So let's go ahead and click on date and see what happens, right? The moment I click on date, it is throwing me an error because uh, Power BI is not able to identify that it is a date say, directly from the text uh, format which we imported, right? Now, let us go back and remove the step that we just applied, okay? So, we have the text. Now, what we need to do is we need to go to the data type text and select whole number, right? The moment you select whole number, Power BI will classify that particular column as a number, right? Now, the next step here is we will, we will apply this as a uh, date uh, column right and then you get this pop-up here change column type the selection column as an existing type conversion do you want to replace the existing conversion or preserve so basically power bi is telling you do you want to replace we've already applied the text to whole number uh, transformation right now it is asking us do you want to replace that directly with date or do you want to add that as an additional step if you say replace current, it will throw an error. Basically, what it is doing is directly the what we did here, right? From text to directly to date, this is what is happening here, right? So we don't want to do that. We want to first add a, as a whole number, change the formatting or data type to whole number, and then change this to date. And when this dialog box, po dialog box pops up over here, click on add new step. This will make sure that the date format is converted into the right format from the whole number right and then now you can click on the close box and click on do you want to apply the changes click on yes and and now here you can see once this gets applied the date format will now change here right however you will see that you know it's a very uh, elaborated uh, format i don't want that way so i will click here on the due date and i will go to the columns column tool uh, tab over here and from this particular drop down i will select what i like over here i like the simple formatting which just says date month and year and we have now fixed the date format issue that we had in power bi i hope this video has helped you you've learned something new please consider subscribing to my channel for more such tutorials